hi guys welcome to my youtube channel so i am not a huge hand bag person i prefer actually i prefer clothes everybody has their thing that's my thing but i've been on the look out uh i have been on the hunt for a classic boat i've been eyeing this tote by kate spade and i am just in the market for a green tote um maybe forest green or khaki green anything green anyone who knows me well they should know that i love green <laughs> so yeah and this is what i found i got this i love the shape of this tote it's 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 absolutely the gorgeous classic style I'm not a fan of tassels, but I could have, I had the option of taking it off or not. But what I got so disappointed about with this bag, and I've been trying it, I've been testing it with lots of outfits, and I, I've been trying to work with it, but it's not really working for me, unfortunately. I think the strap is a little bit too thin look at how thin it is there's no padding and it makes me feel that it would not be able to withstand all the pressures or it would dig into my shoulders um, instead of providing the padding protection that I was looking for in an everyday bag and again the second thing that sort of turns me off from this bag is the fact that in the store it looks green and it's not at all green it's actually aqua so as you can see from this cutout the bag is definitely not green and you can definitely compare it with my plant my plant is green and that's the exact color green I was looking for and this is not green Oh, this is a bit frustrating and it's definitely a deal breaker for me because I want exactly what I want and this is definitely not going to work. I must add the bag has great features. I love the pebbled leather, the gold details, so, but that's it. While I love the size of it and the shape of it as well, I am actually leaning towards probably returning this bag because it may not work for me. Yes, while I love the size and I love the shape and I just I also love the inside as well. It's it's pretty spacious. It can hold my laptop, it can hold everything that I want it to hold, but it's I don't like if you going to invest in a bag you have to love absolutely everything about it and I am not sure if you guys remember my luxury affordable luxury haul bags and there are a few bags out there that I just see and fall in love with on site and just buy and these are they and of course I have not regretted it since I love these bags they have really, really worked out well for me. I have not regretted these purchases at all. I just love them. So when I invest in pieces like these, I like to know that they would be around and I would fall deeper and more in love with them every day as I go along because that's what things are all about. And people, the more they're around you, you're supposed to fall in love with them, right? Well, ideally. <laughs> But anyway, um, and I don't love the straps. They are not working for me. And I don't really love the color because I guess I may, I could fall in love with the color, but it's not what I was looking for. And sometimes when you think that you are satisfied with something, 
and you try to hold on to it thinking you're gonna fall for it <laughs> sometimes it's just a waste of time to do so take it from me <laughs> uh yeah so i have not fallen in love with it and i have i have worn it quote unquote and i mean i have um tried it and paired it with different outfits but for some reason it's not as versatile as i would love it to be and i don't feel comfortable with this strap it's it's annoying me so this is what it looks like and if you notice carefully i tried to match it with my green shoe nah it didn't work <laughs> So yes, it's definitely not the bag for me. So here again, I am really trying to work it with my green pants. <laughs> and I thought that it would still work, but despite all my best efforts to really try to get it to work, and I like to try it at least three times. And I did. But it's still not working. So, yeah. <laughs> no. It's a no. Here I am again. <laughs> this is the third effort. It's still not working. <laughs> No, I may take it back and probably exchange it for a different bag or just wait until I find the ideal one. <laughs> I am not very happy with this one, so it may have to be returned. I am seriously considering returning it and let's see how that goes.
Can I see the back? How long have you had it? Uh, 2015. Oh, okay. So, do you think it's... I noticed that it's kind of stripping a little up yeah. there. Okay. Is it like, what the, what the price? I wanted to like give a review of it because I'm thinking of buying one. I actually got one and I don't know if to keep it. Uh, this happened like recently, so it's ah. after. Oh, okay. okay. So the condition of her bag definitely persuaded me even more to return mine. <laughs> As you can tell, this is me at Nordstrom returning my bag and that's the bag that I was contemplating buying and as you may have seen in a previous video, I did buy it but at that time I was just testing it out. So yeah, it works out really great and I'm quite pleased so much for um, allowing me to share them with you and I just want to let you know that whenever you're considering buying any sort of luxury items or even non-luxury items you must absolutely be in love with it because if you're going to bed at night and you're still thinking oh my god I don't think I like the strap or I don't think I like the cutout or I don't think I like the lack of space whatever it is that's bugging you it means that you're not gonna love it you're not gonna fall in love with it so you might as well invest wisely so that's my encouragement to you and I hope you enjoy this video and I'll see you in the next one thanks for watching